It's 8 a.m. in New York City. Where's my happy hour? All right, welcome back to the Happy Hour, guys. We are here at the corner of Mulberry and Spring Street because we're here today at the Spring Lounge, which is right behind me. This bar I love for sheer moxie because this is the only bar I know of that opened during Prohibition. That's right, Prohibition was on and the brave souls that ran the Spring Lounge decided to open a bar. It was basically a beer bucket takeout. You would bring in your pail, they'd fill it with beer, you take it home. For a while it was known as Chappies in the 30s and 40s. And at one point, locals just called it the Shark Bar. What do you mean a Shark Bar? That's weird. <laughs> I know, isn't it? And after that, in the 40s and 50s, uh, the ownership, let's just say, there are rumors that they were connected, if you know what I mean. In fact, one of the former owners uh, died under, shall we say, mysterious circumstances in Staten Island. But today, the Spring Lounge is still here and it's better than ever. It's actually one of the premier beer bars in New York. Very well known. We love beer. We love beer. Tell us about the hot dogs and the beer. I'm so glad you asked. So on Wednesdays at five o'clock, they serve beer. Well, they always serve beer, but they serve hot dogs cooked in beer. Woohoo! And it's free. <laughs> This is Patricia Valeri, yes? Yes, yes. She's the bartender here at the Spring Lounge, and she's been here since when? I've been here uh, 11 years. That's fantastic. <laughs> that qualifies you for the Bartender Hall of Fame slash Most Valuable Bartender ranking. I've been here quite a long time, yes. It's a very friendly bar. It's a round bar, and I think people like to like converse, and there's lots of good, cool conversations going on. It's a sh horseshoe bar, which is unique, right? It's very unique. <laughs> Tell us about the sharks. Apparently the old owner was an uh, advent deep sea fisherman and he apparently caught all these sharks. They're replicas, but he did catch them all. How do you catch a replica? No, I do you go replica fishing? Yeah, he, he wouldn't sell the bar to the current owner unless we kept all the sharks on the wall. Tell us more about the shark fisherman. Yeah, I was um, you know, involved in the mob and stuff. So. <laughs> he liked this whole area, obviously. Um, and I heard he got sent down sent down <laughs> where <laughs> he's with the fishes we're here with Tim Reinke who is one of the owners here at the Spring Lounge this is a this is just a classic New York bar it's one of the it's one of the best bar spaces in the city great place to day drink we open at 8 a.m. day drinking that's my new favorite word <laughs> we hear that you have a morning drinking club how does that work oh yes the early morning drinkers society you need to come in for 30 days. They don't have to be in a row. Yet we get you keep your time card behind the bar. You get stamped every time you come in. Once you're done, you have to come in between 8 and 12. And then after that, you become an official member. You get a card with your picture on it, and you get a dollar off uh, anything you want from 8 to 12. Well, we love this place. We love the fact that you guys are still making bars like this happen. We think that it's uh, essential to a city like this. Yeah, we'll be around for a while. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers. You gonna finish that? Looks good. Come here often? I bet you're killer with the ladies. <laughs>